What's up guys, Matt here, back with another video on the channel and today we have uh, the teaser trailer for the new tour. So we're in the Piranha Plant tour right now and uh, let's get ready, let's get excited for what's coming next. I'm going to be reacting and then we're going to be doing a little bit of analysis on what's, what are the items that are returning, what might be in a pack, what might be in a pipe and um, anything else we can pick up on. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go into the news and we've got a preview. All right. Okay, so next up is the Ocean Tour. Very good. So we saw from the teaser image last night that we've got Daisy Cruiser as the a new course, um, which is returning from uh, games such as Double Dash um, and I think some of the later later ones as well. Um, pretty excited to play on this course, guys. I've never played it before. Um, so as someone who's newer to some of these uh, courses, it's, it's pretty exciting. And um, I don't know about you guys, but I just love going on cruise ships. And this is going to be a really cool addition to the game. I think this is something like our 10th new retro course this year. So this is pretty fantastic. Um, and here we go. Let's check out what else is new. The summertime celebration is here. Cool. Awesome. So they're bringing more and more of these two uh, two tour celebrations. I think it's pretty cool because it means that we're going to have a second, uh, you know, a second uh, tour which will be within the same theme so we can see more retros we can see more uh, returning items and things like that so it's also worth thinking about what's missing from this and what might come back wow the ocean tour trailer is available now and check this out look at this thumbnail so we've got straight away it looks like we do have another daisy alt with only <laughs> one tour in between we've got two daisies back to back and it looks like we've got daisy a sailor maybe uh, she's got like the hat and the scarf and the shorts <laughs> gotta love those shorts right that's that's hilarious um but yeah daisy sailor man i really hope that the the shorts are a um a a clue to her special skill which i'm hoping is gonna be giant banana um that will be the fourth giant banana option we've had this year if that's the case so should be exciting and in this and then straight away next to her we see sailor toadette really interesting so we've got straight away our week one and week two pipe uh options and i'm guessing daisy will be the week one option and then uh, toadette will be the week two spotlight in the background we can see mario swim yet we're in the um cheap charger i think uh, no cheap snorkel and then we see rosalina swimwear in the sunny surf sailor which is brand new to the all clear pipe it's uh it's a big card it's a giant hitbox card so it's a it's a pretty good one in terms of that the average value not the average most best value because it's themed to some of these beach courses but hey who knows what's going to get buffed in this next um tour and we've also got the me racing suit wave 11 and straight away we've got the image is revealed, so we can see the cheap, cheap, and the dolphin option, which was uh, predicted and guessed. Um, so it's going to be interesting. We'll check that out in a moment. But let's start today with the Ocean Tour trailer. Let's jump to YouTube and check it out. All right, here we go. Okay. Wow, that's a cool card. Oh, look at that pink card. Pink jet cruiser. Ah, okay. That's from turning on. Oh! Oh, 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 Okay guys, so we've got heaps to go through, so let's go through, watch it again, and um, pause it as we go through and take a look at everything we see. So first up we see um, the, the thumbnail image here. And here let's take a look, so I can see Yoshi and Iggy in the background, but in the foreground here we've got the brand new Daisy Sailor in a Bad Wagon Alt card. So it looks like... I don't know, like the holiday bad wagon, the cruiser bad wagon. I don't know what they'll call it. It's actually got a sunflower on it, so maybe, maybe it's the flower wagon or something, something like that. We already had the, I can't remember what Rosalina Volendam's one's called, but the flower cart maybe. Uh, is this the flower bad wagon? I don't know. 
Maybe it's the flower good wagon. <laughs> okay, so here we go. And okay, here we go. So now we've got, I'm guessing this is going to be the week two pipe. Interesting. Unless that's a different surf sailor. I kind of confuse those ones, but this is an interesting pipe because we've got Rosalina Swimwear, who's a valuable coin boxer still. She's got the large hitbox. She's um, got some good value. Losing value quickly, though, um, to some of these newer items like Yoshi Gold Egg, who's taken some of her uniques. Um, and then we've got Sailor Toadette in this new pink jet cruiser. So should be an interesting second week pipe. I think some people will go into that second week pipe. It might come down to what item um, Daisy and Toadette have. So it should be interesting. <laughs> that pink jet cruiser. Gotta love it. All right, and then here we see... Some interesting items, we've got Daisy Swimwear, we've got Charging Chuck, we've got Funky Kong, and who is that? Just need to pause that. Oh, Luigi Vacation back again, interesting. So my guess, if you can see, they're all in the pipe frame cart, so my guess would be that they're going to be... Uh, they're going to be some pack items, or maybe it could be a special pipe. Could be a driver and a special pipe, which would be interesting. Um, but yeah, I'm really not sure. And then we've got normal Rosalina, you know, super Rosalina in the watermelon cart. So this is the alt of the pumpkin cart. You can see the shape, the size. That's definitely the pumpkin cart. But it's it's so much better because it's the watermelon cart. It's a small hit box. It's not a large cart, but it just looks flipping cool, guys. That is cool. Uh, could be a special pipe uh, spotlight. And then in the background, here we go, Lakitu party time in the jukebox buggy. So there are plenty of people who uh, who need that cart, um, and it looks like it's finally returned. It has some great unique value, um, pretty meta right now. So that could be, either these could be some packs, or this could be a really interesting special pipe. So I also see the, is it the orange streamliner? Uh, it's not the same cut we've had this new Lightning McQueen streamliner, Lightning streamliner. Um, I think that's the orange streamliner returning, which is interesting with Toad Picker in there. I wonder if these drivers are just a, a misnomer, they're not in there at all, or whether they're packs. And there's also, ooh, White Birdo in there too. All right, so we've got some interesting, and White Birdo in the Jet Cruiser. So my prediction here would be that this, hmm... I think this is going to be our packs, guys, um, which makes me wonder, is this going to be our special pipe? Hmm, we'll have to wait and see. It could be a, yeah, it could be really interesting, but some pretty valuable items here, guys. We've got Charging Shark, we've got Luigi Vacation, um, we've got some, and we've got Daisy Swimwear, we've got these new carts, we've got White Birdo, should be really interesting, guys. And then take a look at that. Is that Singapore? Man, this is, this is, is that Daisy, is that Daisy Cruiser? Or is this, is that Singapore? It, it looks, no, it's, it is Singapore. Because you can see the building with the, um, with the, the big thing up on top that you, that you drive on. But it looks like this could be a, a different variant of, of Singapore. And you can see, the leaves up the top there, I can see something pink in the background, so, is, I don't know guys, is that Singapore returning? That, that would explain why it didn't return in the Metropolitan uh, Fest, and also could be a really cool addition, but this is fascinating, we got a new retro, and a returning city with a potential alt version. Um, don't want to get too ahead of myself guys, but that's really, really interesting. And also in this um, image, we've got the, it looks like the two brand new uh, gliders. And the, the this glider here, it looks like a flower manta or flame manta. It's kind of hard to tell, but that looks like it kind of matches Daisy's cart. And then we've got uh, the Luigi Vacation Rainbow Balloons, I'm going to call them. Just because those glasses, man, you got to love that. But... Uh, interesting, interesting, and um, these could be pack, these could be in the special pipe, they've actually, it looks like they've mixed it up quite a lot, so, yeah, your guess is as good as mine for how they're going to break this down. Okay, 
and there it looks like it's just all the drivers we've had so far. All right, guys, so some really interesting stuff coming to the game. I just really want to go back and take a, just one last look at this. Um, one last look, last look. So we got we got Daisy Cruiser, and then this here is also Daisy Cruiser. Might be a different section or a different version. That looks like maybe the RT. We've got Wario Shipyard back again. It's been in a lot of a lot of courses. Here, what are we looking at here, guys? This has got to be Singapore here. Singapore, and it looks like it's Singapore lit up at night like it was originally, and there's all this colour. Look at all this colour going on. Really amazing. Even those um, geysers look like they've got different colours. All right, guys, it should be pretty, pretty amazing. Um, so get excited for that. Um, let's go back and check out the Me Tour, uh, the Me Racing Suit trailer. See what we can find in here. So we're going to get the, um, just before I hit play, um, my prediction for Daisy uh, Sailor is going to be Giant Banana. Toadette Sailor could be, I think, Dash, dash Ring. Um, and then we're about to find out what Cheap Cheap and uh, Dolphin Special Kit skill is. I actually predict uh, Dash Ring for Dolphin as well. And I think for the Cheap Cheap, I think it's just got to be Bubble Guys. That would be our first high-end bubble driver, which I just think would be hilarious. But let's go ahead and check it out and see what skills they end up getting. Here we go. Alright. Oh! <laughs> I was right, guys. <laughs> it's our first high-end with the bubble skill. That is so funny. Oh my gosh. Some people are going to go and meme out and take this thing to level 8 just for fun. But, okay, my prediction is that we get a buff to the bubble skill. It's going to it's gonna break the meta. It's going to be better than coin box, guys. I'm calling it now. Okay, yes! Okay, my prediction's right for both me suits. This is awesome. Uh, man, obviously I'm uh, clued up here, so... We've got the Dolphin Me Racing Suit, which I think just looks really cool, really cute, really funny. Okay, here's the real question though, are we going to get a Wave 12 teaser? There's still 10 seconds less than in this trailer, so let's see what happens. Yep, we sure do. And what is that? It looks like it's got a hat on. Man, I am so bad at this, guys. It looks... Oh, you know what that is? That... It kind of looks like a... Mm, no, we've already got a Donkey Kong suit. It can't be Donkey Kong. It looks like a face on the back. Maybe it's like a... Oh, I don't know. It's got like a, quite a round sort of head. And I can't see anything but monkey now. So I'm sure we'll just go on Twitter and everyone will tell us what it is. Um, so let's go over to Twitter now and uh, check it out, see what people were saying over there, what they're picking up in the in the trailers and everything. And a massive shout out to Tortocart while we're here. Help us grow their channel. Make sure to go over there and subscribe. Let's see if people are sounding off in the comments and what they're saying. New suits incoming, alright. High end bubble character. Mint chocolate chip me suit. Cool. Okay. Mint chocolate chip me suit. Maybe my ability to know Mario Kart lore is, is not good. Grotus costume? Grotus? It's ice cream. Uh, <laughs> Wow, we're getting some wildly different predictions here, guys. Interesting. Interesting. Ice cream track from the booster course leak. All right. Yeah, so um, we have been seeing this. Um, so people... Okay, so it seems like people were saying that this could be an ice cream. So, 
yeah, I, I kind of get that. It's really hard to predict. It lo doesn't really look like ice cream, but it could be. Um, and in the booster course DLC for Mario Kart 8 uh, Deluxe, um, there is a, a new Nitro course developed specifically for Mario Kart, which is brand new, uh, not a retro returning or anything like that, and it's got ice cream theme to it. So who knows? Uh, I would say that's a good prediction, though, because we're going to have this two-tour summer celebration. But for new Nitro courses coming to the tour, like how often is that going to return? That's going to be the really interesting thing, guys. And, you know, I would say that this game is becoming very different now. Um, in terms of investment, in terms of when you decide to spend your tickets and what items to go in on, uh, we're just getting so bombarded with new items, uh, new courses. And, you know, if you think back, uh, it's been tours and tours since we had Mushroom Gorge return. It's been tours and tours since we had, you know, um, uh, Yoshi Valley return. So these brand new retro courses... Um, I mean, there's so many courses in the game now that they're not returning all the time. You know, think about um, Choco Mountain. We haven't had that for over maybe almost two months now. So it's a really different game and you have to be, uh, you have to know when to save. Um, I didn't go in for PD Piranha at all. I didn't have the rubies and, you know, I'm sa saving up. I've got my own goals in the game. So, you know, um, let me know in those comments down below. Will you be spending your rubies? Will you be spending your tickets? Will you be saving them? Um, what looks exciting for you in this tour? Um, guys, we've just got just to gotta say, like, this game is awesome. There's, there's new stuff every single tour. Every two weeks, we get excited. It's like opening a Christmas present. So if you want to join me on Christmas morning to open my Christmas presents, then um, join me for the live reaction uh, next Wednesday night, New Zealand time. Um, uh, I will be joining, uh, it, it won't be live, it will be recorded, um, but make sure you join, uh, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel, get involved with what we're doing here guys, and um, have a great rest of your tour, and we'll catch you in the ocean tour, see you later guys.